the strategic rocket army museum was created where one of the missile silos used to be before. It probably has no analog in the world. The museum shows the missile silo site, launch control center, guardhouse and a set of special equipment that supported missile maintenance. Of missile troops. I would like to hand this key to the ex commander of the missile regiment, who is now the director of this museum, Polkovniku Taranenko. Colonel Taranenko. I думаю, I think that this museum is created not to be used uh, I, I think that the purpose of this museum is not to get scared the visitors with the power of these weapons. The purpose is not to become sad because of the fact that these weapons were eliminated. But on the contrary, the purpose of this museum is that the visitors of this museum feel secure. Прошу, пане полковнику. Here you are. The visitors of the museum get to know that during the Cold War this was the site for deployment of the 43rd Rocket Army, one of the strongest in the world. Its nuclear potential kept the whole world in fear and trepidation. The Soviet Union arsenals located in Ukraine were sufficient to destroy the USA several times. The intercontinental ballistic SS-24 missiles were the latest invention and the pride of the military technical thought of the USSR. They called them scalpel in the West. Each of them with a surgical precision was capable of sending its 10 warheads to the distance of 11,000 kilometers and burn to ashes 10 big cities of any country in the world. Were the United States afraid of the Soviet nuclear weapons? There was fear throughout the world for 40 years of mutually assured destruction, of the fact that there might be accidental launches, quite apart from deliberate ones, that could terminate life for millions of people.